Good morning. Good morning. And welcome to day four of our Celebrity Summit cruise. So today the ship is going to be in Nassau mm -hmm. and we are about to go get some breakfast and some coffee. Uh, well, Will hasn't had any coffee yet this morning. No, so. I'm very tired. We had a bit of an adventurous night. Yeah. So for the first time ever, I've gotten seasick feelings once before mm -hmm. and that was when it threw a hurricane. So for the, I guess, second time I've ever had like true seasick feelings, it actually got me this time. So mm -hmm. we had a bit of a rough night. Um, I, I don't know. We can't tell if it's just where we're at on the ship or if it's just like maybe that was the night, but we are very, um, and maybe you used to sleep in our orientation of our bed, but we have very, very And we ended up laying swing. sideways, so we go back and forward instead of side to side, so. Mm -hmm. I don't know, but that, that, that sucked. Mm -hmm. That was not fun. <laughs> so I, I have more sympathy for people who say that they get seasick and that's why they don't want to cruise. I totally mm -hmm. get it. Um, it made me think like maybe we shouldn't go on this class of ship again. Like, yeah, because we didn't know if there's the size of the ship that just can't stabilize, especially going at such high speeds. Maybe the age. I'm not sure. Um, but, but yeah, so I feel better this morning. So we're going to try to go get some breakfast. Mm -hmm. And today the schedule is pretty light. I think there's a trivia mm -hmm. around 10 15. And then there's not very much because we're going to be in Nassau. And so we probably aren't gonna get off this ship because we already did like the fish fry mm -hmm. thing yesterday um but we'll see usually we do spend one day to kind of experience the ship a little bit empty on a sure. cruise and we have been to nassau before so we'll probably stay on the ship and then um tonight we, there's a few activities so we'll just see what we get up to mm -hmm. so you guys should come join us and see what happens today yeah. but this is our last day. It's very sad. Then we're back into Miami to fly out, get back to our little base state that no one knows where it's at. I know it's so funny when people are like, where are you from? And I'm like, Oklahoma. And you know, these are all international people. People, They're like, I don't know what, I don't that, know is. what that is. <laughs> and I'm like, do you know what Texas is? And they're I've like, heard yeah, of I've it. heard of Texas. And I'm like, okay, well, it's north of that. <laughs> so. But I guess we, we also didn't get the uh, Oklahoma song, the uh, oh yeah, on the musical yeah, trivia. Yeah, we had musical trivia, and we did not but, get the I Oklahoma mean, song correctly. But I, I think I've we're all kind it. of embarrassed at that musical. I've seen it twice, maybe. I don't know. If I've I don't seen think it. I've actually. I don't. I don't really care for the Oklahoma. Oklahoma musical. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe people do. If you do, let us know yep. down below. But we're about to get out of here. We'll need some coffee. Mm -hmm. I need some toast. So. Let's go. Come on. Come on, guys. So, something I do enjoy is that there are so many stairs. There's stairs. There's three sets of stairs. And it's, for the most part, all the way through. Um, so all the way some, down, up and down. So, and what you're saying is you like that there are aft, midship, and forward stairs and elevators. Yes, and it actually goes all the way through. There's no, like, stopping for the most part. I can tell. Of course, there's some floors you can't really get on. You have to go through uh, cabin areas, but like, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of stairs. It's not too many, because I think because there's three sets of stairs, not too many people on the stairs. Yeah, that's true. Because on the royal ships, there's usually only two out and four. But Carnival has three. Yeah. Alright. Okay. Coffee. Coffee, coffee, coffee. 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 Goodbye. So. What we what we get from the coffee shop, my dear? So they have a lot of different options. So they have an apple turn on top. So we're gonna try that. Mm. It's very good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then and it's like oh, oh goodness, a jelly filled donut. Yeah. I don't know what flavor it is. Right now. Oh, and I also got a caramel macchiato, iced caramel ma macchiato coffee. Do I have the little plan? It's strawberry. Okay. That's kind of. I think we got one more for you. Um, just a donut, right? Cinnamon sugar donut. Sugar donut. Mm -hmm. 
least favorite? Least favorite. But still really good. Mm -hmm. It's not as good as the one we had on Royal, but it's, it's not as cinnamony, sugary okay. as that one. Like I could use a little bit more cinnamon sugar. Yeah. Let me try one more time. That's good. That's been trying pastries with your hands. Tune in for the next episode. I'm sure it'll be one. Yeah. So Alright you guys, here's my omelet. 25 minutes later, it's done. So the process to get an omelet on Celebrity is you go up there and you order and they write your name on it. And they give you an estimated time frame to return to get the omelet. And it's just really chaotic and not a great process. It's leaving a lot of people frustrated. So I think they need to work on that. Alright, well I'm going to eat it before it gets cold. All right, we're at trivia, and we're getting to do the morning trivia, so we gotta get our name on the paper. All right, we're all ready. Let's see how we do. All right, guys, we are arrived at Nassau, and we are backing into our old friend, next to our old friend. Look who that is, can you see who it is? Let me zoom in a little. There you go, Liberty of the Seas. Old friend Liberty. We got the Carnival Conquest beside us on the other side. We've never been on this one before. We are? Are we? We'll have to see because we were on the Valor and it's the same class as the Conquest. You can get the sky over there behind you. You can kind of see the NCL, yeah. All right, so we're gonna take a look at what they have on the buffet for lunch. We've also got some condiments here. Mushroom masala, aloo jira. It looks really good. These are the condiments they have out. They have these in about five different stations. All right, we have the Mexican station. We got chicken fajitas, beef fajitas. We actually have tortilla chips, cheese sauce, refried beans, and chili con carne. And then we have the toppings. We got some tomatoes, onions, jalapenos, guacamole, and sour cream. We got the dessert section right here. This changes every day. So we got the special fried chicken, buffalo chicken wings, lobster mac and cheese. Then we have some roast lamb, roast beef. <laughs> <laughs> Roast turkey. That's funny. Can we sit outside and then get it here? Salad station. This is a really cool station they have because they have pita bread, then they have baba ganoush, beetroot hummus, Lebanese cheese, spinach, feta hummus, and plain hummus back here. And this has been here every day. This is your Caesar salad station. So you've got the romaine lettuce, Caesar dressing, Parmesan croutons, and bacon. Here's another salad station. It's the same as the previous one, just a different location. We have some different cheeses that you can get. Some breads. Hi. And we have some different prepared salads and some cold cuts. We got grilled vegetables, whole roasted vegetables, baked potato fixing, grilled chicken, grilled pork chops, grilled fish, uh, mar marisco, some more lobster mac and cheese, Vietnamese fried rice, Thai beef curry, Asian vegetable stew. Today they have a Vietnamese chicken pho for Panini station. There's a pizza station here. 
So here's plate number one for me. Some kind of, I think it's Vietnamese uh, fried rice, uh, Asian pork curry, and vegetable curry. And we have got some cold cuts and a salad to start with. Hello, so I'm gonna talk about the um, Nassau port situation. So we're not gonna go, we're not gonna get off the ship, but it seems like they made quite a bit of progress on their port. Um, looks like there's easily four four ships can get get docked. So that's great. Um, it's been like that for a while, but like now that I get to actually see it, it's good. They have their walkways done for all the all the four ports. Um, it seems like really everything's done except for their main little station area uh it seems like that's still under construction so you still have to go around that uh town walkway area but other than that it seems like they're making great progress on their little port i'm glad that the people in the government of the bahamas are going to get to have that so they can get more ships in and bigger ships in and they can make some money yeah that's just my little update it looks like they're it's going pretty well and maybe able to even fit another ship or two in front of the Liberty right here. So I mean, it's good. It's good for them. Good for them to get some ships in every day. Just want to give you guys a little update. Bye for now. Hi guys. Um, so we are to watercolors. A little event at 2:30. Um, so we get to paint with watercolors. Um, Joanne's gonna do this. This time I will not be doing it. It's very hard to get a good shot because of the back. <coughs> back with the guy. I gotta get some water. Oh, okay. I'm talking to you guys a little bit. Show off some art. So I'm checking again. Had to go get me some more cookies because they are that good today. It's really good. Um, I really like the clientele on here. I like that there are multiple um, nationalities and stuff on the ship. People from um, Canada and from the UK on the ship. And I'm a big fan. I really like the clientele. I like that people clap for every song out on the pool deck. It's strange to me. Most of the time, people don't just listen to music and it's like, oh, okay, you're just music background. But yeah, that they stop and clap. That's really cool. Maybe that's just people from here, or what, but I don't know. Just wanted to comment on that. Okay, back to work. So, look at the photo that Miss Joy Lee made. Kind of used like, this as our inspiration. Yeah. So, I think you did a great job, especially with the colors that we had. There's some colors that, of course, did not translate too well. Yeah, I still feel like maybe. Yeah. Yay, watercolors. Why I'm didn't you do any watercolors? I'm not an artist. An artiste. You're not an artiste? I'm not an artiste. But I had lots of cookies. I'm an artist in food. And eating food. Alright, I guess that's fine. Hi there. So yeah, uh, now I think about five minutes. Yeah, five minutes on straight. I'm gonna go straight, so we'll see how that goes. <laughs> really, it's better at straight. Huh? So you're better at straight than I am. Oh, I don't know. Well, I'm better at most things anyway. I'm just yeah. kidding. Yeah, I, I, I agree with that 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 statement. I'll talk to you guys a little later after we do some straight. Bye for now. What? Where do we go? Dead. Yeah. Dead. Playing dead. Walking dead. Little people. I, I don't. I don't know. Here we go, Wilford, Oklahoma! One word. Oh, Spider-Man. Oh, Spider yeah, yeah, Two words. 
A dinosaur. Dinosaur. Godzilla? Two words. First word. Oh, circle and looking. Uh, the sky. Just looking at the sky. Basketball. Hoop Space Jam. Hulk. No. Yes, correct. Oh, that's all. Woo! Good job! So, look what we got. Well, that's pretty good today. And some pineapple, some cheese, some oil, some tomatoes and cheese over there, and then some wrapped prosciutto with the breadsticks. Uh, Joy's getting some water, so she'll be here in a little bit, and then we'll get in some more funness later. And we're gonna check out what there's eat. So yeah. Talk to you guys later. Bye. Hi. It's us again. And it's that time again. Already. Would you believe it? What time is it? I have no idea. <laughs> I, I didn't know she was going to say this, so I have no idea. It's time to go to dinner. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, so we've gotten changed. Um, I still have my hair in pigtails. That's fine. This is just what <laughs> this is just gonna be what it is gonna be today. And then we'll have his anchor shirt on. Yeah. And then I have my new uh, Torrid dress I got. That's just like a little. I will we'll show you. It's just like a little like jersey dress. It's got pockets. And then it has like a longer sleeve on it, which I like. And I feel like you can dress this up or down, so you could take it on a cruise and put like a cute little necklace with it or anything and then you could have it for your cruise because it doesn't wrinkle that's what i'm trying to say it didn't wrinkle mm -hmm. and that's really important so yeah um there's not really anything on the menu that looks delicious to us yeah we're just gonna get the three get in get out yeah. say goodbye to our our wait staff wait staff because this is the last night of the cruise. Yeah. And then we have to get on an airplane tomorrow. Mm -hmm. We have to fly back to Dallas. We're, Will's just disappeared. So it's just the Jordan show. So we've got to fly back to Dallas. We're supposed to get home around six o'clock. And then we'll probably grab a bite to eat in Dallas. And then we'll probably zip it into Dude on home. Because we have to go to work early in the morning on Tuesday. Yep. I have to be there at 6.45. I have to be there probably earlier. Oh, so oh it's 6.45. So sad. Yeah, but I just have to walk to my office because I'm not going in this week. Yeah. So we will talk to you guys. Maybe we'll talk to you at dinner. Maybe. Maybe. I've seen people doing that, and they, that just seems so brave to me. <laughs> I'm so shy. I'm just, I forget how shy I really am. Like, when I don't know people. He's not shy. I am when I don't know people. Like, I'm very shy. I'm, like, nervous. He doesn't think so. Yeah. But I am. So, we'll see. All right. Let's go to dinner. Come on, guys. Let's go. Not princess chair. Are you a princess? Yep, I'm princess. This is a 
through from this chair because I'm in it. Yeah. So, behind the scenes is us just having dinner. We don't really show dinner. Just want to let you guys see these nice chairs that we get to be in for the past three days. Okay. Bye for now. So we realized that again, we forgot to talk to you guys last night about dinner. Mm -hmm. So last time you left us with din dinner conversation, we weren't too excited about the menu. Mm -hmm. So we got there and I got the Caesar salad again. Mm -hmm. I tried, what is it called? Onion soup, French onion? Yeah, French onion soup for the first time. Yeah, it was good. I liked it a lot. I felt like the bread and the cheese on top are kind of unnecessary. I know that's probably an unpopular opinion. Oh, you feel love the bread. <laughs> but I just, li I liked the soup. It's brothy and it's good. It had a good flavor. I don't know if we're all like that. Um, and then for my main course, I had the pasta primavera mm -hmm. and it was just penne pasta tossed in pesto sauce with mixed vegetables. And then for dessert, I had the creme brulee and it was not my favorite creme brulee. I would say it's it was my least favorite creme brulee that I've ever had. It wasn't awful, <laughs> but it wasn't great. So, um, the crust just wasn't what I was expecting really. It didn't have like that caramelized feel to it. I don't know if they just didn't put enough on it or what. And then the creme brulee was more cold than I wanted it to be. Oh yeah, you need to have a warm creme brulee. Just a little warm. I'm okay with it not being, you know, I want it to be in the broiler for just a little bit longer. Mm -hmm. Maybe that's just my preference. And then Will, what did you have? Um, I cannot remember what I had for appetizer. Um, you had the eggplant caviar. Okay, so that really didn't taste like caviar to me. I don't know what caviar tastes like. But I felt like it gave the feel of a caviar from what my what I thought it would taste like. What was the um, predominant was, flavor though? Um, there was black olive was a predominant flavor. Um, so if you don't like olives, I would not get that. It does say black olives in the like um, ingredient list. But it is, he said it was very olive. But it's very olive-y. Um, and then for my entree, I had the tilapia filet um pretty much was on on a bed of uh pasta uh pasta with tomato like sauce tomato sauce yeah it was no, really basic good. the pasta but she, you said you really liked the I really tilapia. that one i really like the tilapia um and then for dessert i had um, um the cheesecake cheesecake to go uh-huh Oh, and I forgot to tell you guys, I got a side of the stuffing that they had that went with the turkey because I wanted to try it. And it was very different than what we're used to. So it had like meat in it. So like sausage and turkey and it had like bread in it. So I, our families do dressing. Mm -hmm. And I always thought just the difference between the two was one was cooked inside the bird and one was cooked outside of the bird. This must be like a different region's stuffing. Yeah. Because I, I never had anything like that, but it wasn't Or maybe the, even the ship's stuffing. That they were like, we're, this is how we're going to do stuffing. Yeah. I don't know. Let us know what you what kind of stuffing you guys have or, or dressing. Whatever you guys call it. We, we call it dressing. Um, and then I, since he got a dessert to go, I of course had to get dessert to go to go with his so I got a chocolate cake to bring back and the, the cakes on the ship just aren't very good yeah the icing was really good mm -hmm. and the flavors are good it's just like there's something slightly off with the texture of the cake mm -hmm. I don't know I think it's over mixing maybe it's kind of like uh, crumbly like it's got a I don't know I don't know exactly how to describe it it's not like your soft fluffy moist kind of cake Mm -hmm. but 
we'll do a recap of what we thought of the cruise and everything later um since this is our first time on celebrity but we just wanted to finish up the night for you so that you knew how dinner was since we were concerned about it all right well this is going to be the end of our state room time <laughs> this is going to be the end of our uh, vlog for nassau day and then in the morning we are going to pick up with our demarcation morning and our adventures in public transportation we will try to do a little bit better job vlogging the way home to you guys mm -hmm. um so you know what we're doing now yeah so the way here it got a little hectic we're gonna see if we can make it more simple uh because we do want to find a way for everyone to be able to get around using the already there public transportation mm -hmm. so we're gonna try to get back to the airport for two dollars and 25 cents per person again yeah. okay all right so we'll see you then all right thank you guys so much for watching have a good day <laughs>